got the bike. Whoever just followed my sister Nim, don't do that. This girl just hit my mama car. I said I ain't messing with her unless she real, real fine. <laughs> you feel me? I ain't messing with her unless she real, real fine. I, I like this color. I I watched a girl review this one. It looks like you got clear top on it. They're about $150 apart. Why well, I connected. Okay, I'm torn between my color options. I have quite a few questions. Okay. On this style, does this come in this color? Mm -hmm. Like this one? What you have I'll is have what's available? Pretty much. So, I, okay. what I do know, I know none of these Samsung's we're going to have in store, but two or three of these sets we can order and get here probably about 10 days or so. This champagne set, I know we can probably get here in about 10 to 14 days. Mm -hmm. They also carry this set in a uh, black. Only caveat with the black is the black one has the, the agitator. So are you against the agitator or is that um, not your thing? From or? the reviews I watched, I heard mm -hmm. that the impeller was a little bit better. Okay. The only company that makes the removable ones right now is gonna be Whirlpool. Okay. They got those two in ones. We twist it off, pop it off, use it for whatever, yeah. pop yeah. it back in and you're good to go. That set only comes in white. You got this color in black. That set, I'm not sure, I have to look into that, but that set right there, I can already tell you it's on back order. That one? Yeah. That one's too small. Can, it's, it's, yeah, yeah. It's, it's kind of, oh, four, four, four. Okay, no. And that's something else that's driving the price, too, because this is a 5.2, so that's one of your bigger tubs, yeah. as you can see. Yeah, that's what I was looking at. Y'all only got one that's 5.5, though. That's uh, what you want. Yeah, and I think, think uh, LG makes that. It's over uh -huh. on the other side. Uh -huh. yeah. I looked at that one. I will tell one. you on the black one, I've ordered the last three that I've ordered. I've ordered them as a set for customers. They, them things have literally come in at like eight days. I've been waiting on the couch oh, since November. Yeah, that sounds right. <laughs> right. Yeah, yeah. That sounds right on Ten time. days is nothing. <laughs> That's what we try to tell for us. Like people say, two weeks. Like, like, so that's damn, two yeah, weeks that's nothing. It is. Yeah. Yeah. From back for like three months. Oh, they push and it that's back why I, I try to steer because I, I try to be as honest as I possibly can. And I say, look. Before we start with the Samsung, I can tell you what I do know mm -hmm. is available, and then we'll go from there. Well, it's okay. 200 it's and 200 of this at the distribution center. This set here probably will take about 10 to 14 days. Okay. If you get the one in black, I know you're probably going to get that in about 8 to 10 days. All well, the problem is with that, with the black one, it does come with the agitator, so I always want to point that out. Okay, so cancel that out. As long as you get the accessories, Oops. the Liberty, right. Okay. Liberty, bring all that out. You stay out the way, they'll hook all that up for you, you're good to go. So probably about 70, 75 bucks in accessories. Once you get that, there's no additional you know what, installation your, charge. I'll duck like out for your drive. So I'm basically saving three fifty. Um, each one. You said this is champagne, right? Yeah, that's champagne. So, ah, champagne me, please. Okay, yeah, let me get these and those accessories that you're talking about. All right, we can do it. A lot of people don't realize those front loaders, even more so those top loaders. You have to keep those front loaders though, especially like the wash. You got to keep that door open until you breathe. Yeah. But like you, like you say, like the the. the Lining and stuff like that. It's just like water hides in there, water sits in there. You can get mildew smell. I've heard people say no matter how many times they wash their clothes, they can't get this, that 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 fresh clothes mm -hmm. feeling when you wash. They can't get that. Good. <laughs> I always try to do my research yeah. before I make decisions, especially on big purchases. The one I'm getting is the self clean. Okay. Ah, yay. No. Mm -hmm. Yeah, all goes away. Yeah. I'll give you a call when your wash and dry come in, and then we'll get a follow up call with the Liberty team to confirm the delivery. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Better than your couch. Man. <laughs> <laughs> they pushed that couch back, man. America, uh, Great American Home Store. Yeah. First, it was coming with February. Yeah, February turned into oh, April. April, uh, April uh, just April turned into June. July. July just... June. I can kind of see on both sides. I know it's frustrating you, but at the same time, like they're they're probably waiting like everybody else. Mm -hmm. And it's just like a big wave game for everybody. Yeah. You know what Del Brian told me though that I need to think about? Go we'll see if they'll give us sell us the display. The display been set on so you many times. That's the idea. Uh -huh. As you know, at least when it's clean, you know it's brand new, it's just untouched, mm -hmm. you get first person shit. To sit on it, right. You Thank you so much. Get, that's what I'm gonna call y'all back. <laughs> See, like, this is the first time you ever bought something this fast. Whenever I spend my time browsing and studying online, 
I don't need a bunch of time. April the 1st is our delivery date, about two weeks out from what I'm currently filming this. I need to go to Best Buy and buy a camera and then just whatever they decide as far as whether it can be fixed or if I have to get a new one, have two or I could like give it away. Yeah, you can have the base replaced. Yeah, I was looking at it. online. That's not bad. I think the labor will probably be the part that'll be kind of pricey because this is not pricey at all. I love that. As long as you know your plan, that's all that matters. And then they be the ones trying to convince somebody else to do it so they can struggle right with them. Look what I walk into. Look, Greg. <laughs> Come give up for the hug. Okay, I'm just trying to see. They got the new robes. Quite a few of y'all DM me and was like, they got new robes. Oh, I need that pink one, love. And the matching PJs. Don't play with me right now. Outfit of the day. Yes! This is the ones y'all DM me about. Oh, I hope they get my size. I need a medium. Hey, y'all. This is me, Will Greg. And this time, I got a treat. Medium. I'm back. Look. Thank y'all for DMing me about this. Yeah, I think you put the robe in. I don't know what size he got. I got a bigger size. What you mean? This. Medium large. Uh, uh I need that small medium, Mr. Lincoln. I'm an adult. You said you were an adult. You're big. You're an adult. Gonna hit you. That's what my hit other PJ said. It's from here too. I got one like this color already. Oh, it's the spring one. That is cute. I need that. Give me that linen one in a medium. The one I got right here, but this one is more wintry. It is cute. Put it in a basket so I can get it to it. Don't y'all be talking about my nephew clothes either. He wanted to dress himself today. <laughs> Cause I like wearing it. I'm going to wake it off. Call it. There oh, it is. Like, I'm so forgetful. <laughs> Destiny. Yes, sir. I'm just trying to go faster like I'm in a race car. Like I'm okay, in a challenge. Okay, well, well, let's go this way then and let's go find some more jeans. Let me help. Trey, you a non-driver. Jean shorts. Pants. Why not shorts? Because I can okay. look ugly. <laughs> Excuse me? It's about to be spring. Let's go this way. Okay. Look, it has to be a six. Like, that's a five. That's too little. What about this? If it's a six, let me see. Let see? me check the. No, I got the one. That's an eight. Is this too big? I'm gonna look like you gonna fit that seven eight. Yeah. It might I be think I'm too, too big. big. This girl just hit my mama car. We sitting in the line at McDonald's just trying to order some food. And she just boom, just hit us just now. Oh my god, it's a young black girl. She like, I don't even know. Crack the window. Girl, she just ran into the car. She's so She asked my mama, did she run into her? How we run into you if we in front of you waiting to be next? What you say? I don't go for the I'm from Cowboy. Hey, wait. Oh, somebody just wet his sweepy car. We had Meg Gone. Well, you ain't get her information or nothing. Uh -uh, what you think something could be wrong? God, what'd she say? You somebody just, said, it, was a, it was a oh, young you lady here. She, she could get caught. my tag number so I hit her and pull it off, good. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. Cause she might lie on anything. That was his sweepy car. I was so mad. I said I don't go for the outfit of the cowboy. You too much for me. Girl, we sitting there trying to get out of McDonald's. She bumped the back of it while we sitting here. And Ma saying it's okay. I ain't going for this. What? <laughs> I, don't, I 
Why am I gold car? Ain't nothing wrong with the car. Ain't nothing wrong with the car. I mean, if ain't nothing wrong with it, no, then. Right, she said she was looking down and her foot eased off the brake. Thank God she didn't step on it. What you mean? Thank God. She can't do it. Next time she can't do that. She has a lot of money. Nobody said you should have got her number. She's going to jump out of the car and lie instead of just apologizing and owning up to what she did. She's just playing bumper cars and McDonald's. Why? Why Dominique? Dominique? Why exactly? She just playing bumper cars while Dominique. <laughs> <laughs> no, she can't do this. You probably like good tonight. Mm, my chicken good, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> that's good. I'm gonna taste them. How you know it's good? You didn't taste it yet. Mmm, that's so good. <laughs> <laughs> exactly what that tastes like. <laughs> exactly. Psycho when my new joint hit, just can't sit. Gotta get jiggy with it, ooh, that's it. Now, honey, honey, come ride. DK and Y, all up in my eye. You, got you know how you just tuck stuff away where it don't belong? I was looking for my fashion tape, my double-sided tape, where we went out to that level two event where I had on, like, the green outfit. I just found it. And my little strap converter thing. I'm going to put this in the drawer with the bras so that I'll know where it is next time. How about this? <laughs> So when cleaning my guest bathroom, I like to start off first with just spraying the room with Lysol. I change clothes, it's like some cleaning clothes. And it's mostly clean in here. But what I like to do is at least make sure as far as germs and everything that this room is sanitized for when people come over. This used to be in my bathroom before moving. So tissue is right here for the guest. On the inside, I normally just keep a few things. So I need to kind of refill this. All right, let's do it. And I can only find one of my gloves, so I'm gonna just wear the left one since I'm left-handed. I'm going to go ahead and remove everything out of the space. Taking the clinical cleaner, this one is by Clorox. It was the first time used. I purchased this from Target. I saw it and just wanted to give it a try. The smell is not too harsh, but it does kill germs and it does what it needs to do, so I would definitely purchase it again. So once I spray that down over the toilet, I'm just gonna take the toilet bowl cleaner and apply that. I like for that to sit a while while we do other things. Removing everything from the sink, I'm going to now spray it down with that Clorox cleaner and then to allow it to sit for a while, I'm just going to go ahead and clean the mirror. Inside of my bottle is the Windex, the yellow one, and that's just like an infused spray bottle. They have their own products, but when I run out, I fill them with whatever I like and then the squeegee is from Ikea. So anytime I clean the bathroom, I'm just showing you all that whatever I would reach for, it's going to say that it kills germs. To ensure that I'm really cleaning it, I go back behind that with the Lysol wipes. And to ensure that any space is clean, regardless of what room I'm cleaning, I like to just wipe things down that people touch with their hands. The lights, um, the soap dispenser, just everything basically. cleaning a majority of the bathroom I double back to the toilet bowl cleaner and now we're going to kind of just scrub and clean that and then I kind of just prop it up flush the toilet and let it kind of just drip and dry inside of the bowl then I put it away now I'm going to take my infused mop this is from Target you can get it at Target I'll link it down below for you all and I just kind of like mop my space with this I do have like the robotic uh, vacuum but occasionally for like a really deep weekly clean I like to kind of just do it myself so after that, I'm just going to reapply everything. If you all like the shelf in the corner that's from Amazon, I'll link it down below. It's perfect for smaller spaces where you still want to store things. And then I just kind of like keep this cute little decorative plant. I keep my poop spray. You spray that in the bowl before you go. Nobody would know what my guest was doing in there, okay? <laughs> and the limited edition for Breeze, the watermelon scent. Thank me later. Like I said, it's limited edition. But if you see it, snatch it up because I've been getting so many compliments on that fragrance. 
period. <laughs> and that's pretty much it for the guest bathroom. After that, I just take the scrubbing bubbles gel dispenser and apply that inside of the toilet just to keep it fresh. for me so like a 10 o'clock appointment morning wouldn't be crazy no yeah. that wouldn't be crazy at all <laughs> okay that oh, would work but trust me i'm the type of person that if i'm home don't come to my house at 10 o'clock <laughs> drink coffee and donuts if you do <laughs> i'm just not a real good morning person you know but that's understandable other than that work that work business that they make me do so mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Okay. Well, thank you much. Ms. Chalmers, look forward to doing this. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. I don't want to get, like, near my bed. Well, y'all probably saw. I may put these clips together. I don't know yet. But if not, I'm currently cleaning up around the house, so I didn't want to sit on my bed. I got a pamphlet yesterday when I was in Lowe's. Because I was just browsing around. I want to get a few things redone in my bathroom. I know a lot of y'all were asking me, like, are you going to change anything? But just speaking particularly about my bathroom right now, I know I want my shower redone. If not the entire shower, definitely I want someone to come in professionally and look at my shower floor. Just like DIY, I've done quite a few things. Purchased every product you can name to try to get out that pink staining. I don't know what it is, but I um, temporarily just kind of ordered a mat from Amazon to put over it. I did at least have it looked at to know that it's safe for me to stand on. I don't think I told y'all that. I can't remember. Cosmetic wise, I just don't enjoy the look of it. Everything else about the shower I love. So I'm also possibly considering having my bathroom cabinets redone because that top part is just mostly decoration. You know how you pull the drawers out? Mine are like for decoration purposes, but I do have cabinet space underneath. And today is currently March the 16th. I'm gonna look into that, get some estimates on everything. Before I press record, she was saying that um, she doesn't really know the pricing of everything from what she does just at her desk. But when it's time for people to process their payments and things like that, she's the person that we call. And when she looks at different invoices, she sees some that may start at like $7,000 all the way up to like $50,000. It really just would depend on what you would want to have done. But when that day comes, I would definitely vlog what I can. That's that update. Back to the cleaning. So unless I'm having company, I don't really have too many dishes on a daily basis. So I don't really like to run the dishwasher that much unless I can really like fill it up. <laughs> and the dish drying rack is from Amazon as well. A lot of the stuff y'all see me use is from Amazon. So definitely check out my storefront. It's always linked in my description box. And I keep everything organized by categories if you want to browse a certain room.
in the chair and I'm on my way. Guess who I just saw? Who? Fed and wet She said, y'all be going out without us. We all the now. I said, let's go out your weekend. <laughs> I got to use my Chick-fil-A gift card. Because it's warm today. Okay. We got some Hershey's Hearts, some Butterfinger Minis, and some Snickers Candy Pop. I don't have any sweet treats to put in here right now, but I am going to just pour these in. So this is my toilet space inside of my bathroom basically even if it looks clean to the eye i like to make sure that there aren't any germs i'm gonna kind of speed through it because i'm basically about to do the exact same thing i just did I was already doing a little bit of cleaning during the morning so this was it for me I was like it's time to take a shower we're about to chill the vlog is going to continue and you all still will see some more cleaning footage but it was a wrap for the day so I'm going to have my shower and then we're going to pick back up with a little bit later let me know if you all are enjoying the clean with me kind of weekly vlog edition um if that's something that I should kind of incorporate along with the weekly vlogs or as a weekly vlog let me know what y'all think so my current lotion when I get out of the shower is by Olay. It has collagen in it. It's supposed to firm the skin. I don't even know if it do that. I just know that I like the scent and I like the way it moisturizes my body, okay? My current facial wash is by Ambi. It's the Cocoa Butter Facial Cleanser. I love Ambi's products. Normally I just go ahead and rewash my hands whenever I forget to do my face and then my body. Um, but I like their products, not sponsored, maybe one day. And I always just notice how when I don't have their products in my routine, there's a different look to my face. It's not terrible, but it's not as even toned, if that makes sense. Love their products, gentle, but effective. I like to pat dry with a paper towel, and then I take this serum that I got from um, Sephora, actually, with some of my points. I don't have it with me right now, so I'll put the name on the screen. Nobody told me to do this. I'm telling you, though, you should try this. I take the 100% cocoa butter stick, the one that's for your lips, and I actually apply it all over my face. Normally, I'll stop right here when I don't feel like going further, but for daytime, I always take a moisturizer that has an SPF in it. This one is by Cetaphil. Currently using it. Currently loving it. So, on episode 15 of Things Destiny Purchases that she thought she was going to use every day is this vibrating facial roller. You get the T-shaped one, and then you also get the one that I'm currently using. Some of the claims is keeping the face smooth, brightening the face, anti-wrinkle, tightening the skin, removing dark under eye circles. Listen, I don't know about all of that. For me, I just enjoy the aesthetic and the relaxation part of me time if that makes sense so if that's a checkbox then i like this okay <laughs> and even if i'm not going anywhere for the day perfume why not today i wore the tiffany for her you i try to eat healthy sometimes y'all realistically speaking like i do my best when i can so i'm gonna pop in this little healthy choice meal from um, I got this from Kroger. Healthy Choices at all the grocery stores. It was kind of decent. My audio has been missing occasionally sometimes. And I saw in the previous video, y'all were like, it was too low or something. So let me know if this video is a little bit better. And I might have to trash some more vlog stuff. So let me know. So on this part, I think I was just telling you all that I like my cousin Charity's braids. And that I might give me some long ones just like it. Oh, I think we ain't there. Remember we made some tacos? Now that was ground beef. Oh. You ain't had no sausage packet in there. You sure? I think we can always order a pizza. I'm just gonna transfer it to this plate. You know that pizza you ordered? Even though I just did good. the dishes, cause I'm a stupid. Well, 
And we got paper plates. I'm tripping. I'm really tripping. Now why I put it on a little plate in there? I just don't be thinking when I press record. Mm -mm, put this back in my thing. I did not eat no sickle sausage. Oh God! What is she oh, eating? What? You don't like frappuccino? No, this is good. Keep in mind that it's almost five o'clock, though. We're gonna be up all night. <laughs> oh, I knew I went crazy when I drank this last time. It took me a long time to go to sleep. I drink them in the morning time for breakfast. A little um power bowl. Tell the story. Rice, broccoli, some little chicken. I just want to know, y'all, when did she eat the with the sausage? Did you leave my pancakes? <laughs> like, where's the sausage? <laughs> what did you do with it? <laughs> I did. <laughs> what are these? Oh, some of these. Some of these. Mm -mm, I didn't steal that. Yeah. Them niggas about to make Rotel. They can run to the store, but I actually got the chow, so I'm not going. We we can chill in the living room. We can blow up that air mattress and get the pillows out. It'll be cute. And pull up a movie. Yeah, I've been cleaning. Oh, y'all heard it. She said it smells good in here. That's that new watermelon for Breeze. I'll be using my plug in. Oh, I like your outfit. See, I gotta start back chocolate rope because that's how I'm gonna be dressed this summer. Yeah, I'm on my boys. I'm all cooking, y'all. There he is. Not the sun coming in right here. And then we're going to watch Ozark. Wait on the hotel and wings to get done. This one, too. Oh, you've been watching it? I ain't finished it yet. Ozark, five. Mm -hmm. They don't even look like they love their money. He most definitely don't. <laughs> like the way they look, they look like they're just so innocent and just scary. When I first said that's it. That's the Febreze watermelon. Yeah, I got some like, I ain't even wash the pad. Yeah, yeah, I got that one in my closet. Get it if you see it, because it's limited Not edition. Uh, you ain't hanging up on the thing? You ain't hanging up on the thing? I'm standing up, you know, my food ain't gonna have nothing for Ozark. Alright, come on. Alright, we'll be right back quick. Alright, then. Right. Whoever just followed my sister, Nim, don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. So naturally right now, this is what my room looks like without me cutting out lights and everything. Um, I like to keep the blinds closed when I'm watching TV so that I don't catch a glare. It is currently 547. So on days when I don't have to film, do no editing. I mean, I do need to edit. So something about touching my camera made the mic like stop working. I think it wasn't plugged in all the way. So whenever I would touch it, it was messing it up. But basically I was just saying, I know I needed to edit. But I was about to watch Ozark instead. I finished all of it as I'm currently doing the voiceover right now. I'm done. I'm excited. I think the new one is about to start soon. Some of y'all were telling me. is a sausage eater so I will have to hide the sausage from now on. Mm. I did not eat that. We never had that. That's all that is. Oh. Bro, stop. I can't do that. That's crazy. Who is it? That's the thing you roll your arms. Nah. Who got it? No, 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 no. <laughs> I can't do it. Me and both can't roll they off. Give me a squat for that. Here. Alright, let's go watch Ozark. Oh, this one is. Y'all can come in here and watch what we see, y'all. See, baby, we're too far for you. You're on season three, but I start off from the one. Now on season one. Mm hmm. Too far back. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm on season two, but I can take it from one because I'm in the beginning of season two. I'm going to put a little bit more meat and cheese on in here. Mm.
Hello, stranger. It's been a minute since we last kissed. By the way, just got in town. And I won't let cumulus clouds all in the sky ruin my vibe. Usually, I don't do this often. But since recruiting, I'm standing here waiting on the water. Look which eye I turned on. The front one. That water ain't hot at all. This is ridiculous. So the way that I like to make my tea once the water has boiled, I take my tea of choice for the day. I was drinking the Yogi Tea Positive Energy. That one is just like the flavor of sweet tangerine. Um, I drink this one only in the morning since it does have caffeine. And I like to add honey and lemon. I didn't have any lemon, but normally I add lemon. Sometimes if I add enough honey and lemon, I can do without the sugar. But I added a very small amount just to taste. Um, and the cute little mug that you all see me using, all of that came together in a little set. One of my subscribers gifted me this, so thank you so much. And I love the little quote that was on there as well. Y'all, I was in the mood to buy a bike. So that's what we're about to do. No, get out with the bikes. They better not be getting a pretty pink when I want. I said I want my damn bike! Okay, that's the pink one I want right here. Okay, here it is. So what bike was this right here? Is this the one I was looking at? Seven speed. Let's go. I want it. <laughs> yeah, I want it. Let's go. Love me. Y'all not be being excited to have a bike. Come on, Martha. Let me get that bike. I rode into the wrong car. I'm like, why well, you didn't say nothing? I got the bike. The bike. We don't need a basket. Oh yeah, right here. My cleaning crew came and did my garage. I just got back. Everything is all clean. I don't stop on too. So that means this right here ain't no sound playing right here. Okay. Once an album is done, it's gonna automatically stop. Show out, Mr. Lincoln. They can't do push-ups like you. Ooh. Take off the note because it's got my dress on here. Y'all know this. Oh, we are going to build this one first because it looks easier. That way I can work my way up to feeling accomplished about building this to tackle that one.
<laughs> but it's okay, it's a press on. I have to just pop these little caps in. It's like a little hole at the top, baby. When I die, put my money in a grave. I really gotta put a couple niggas in a place. Really just slap every nigga in a face. I really might tap till this nigga on my face. Let it slap with the bass. I used to save holes with a mask in a cave. Now I'm like, nah, like It's getting dark, so I'm gonna hurry. The only thing that I currently need to see on me is All right, so I hadn't washed my brushes in a while, so I'm going to do that now. I like to take the dish drying rack and lay that across the sink. And then I take my makeup brush cleaning pad. I add some water to that with the brush add whichever hand soap I'm currently using on top of the pad. And then I just kind of swish the brush around until it's clean. Two things to note whenever I clean my makeup brushes to make sure that they last longer. I never turn it in an upright position to where the water would run directly into my bristles because it'll weaken that spot where the bristles are held in place by that little metal piece. So I always hold them downwards. And then once it's clean, kind of just shake the excess water out that'll help to speed up the drying time. Another tip is I never mix my cream product brushes with the brushes that I normally only have powder on them um and that only applies like if you're trying to wash more than one at a time to make the process go quicker just because that cream any cream products like your contour and all of that it's going to take a longer amount of time to get it clean than your brushes that you only use with powder and then I just leave them to dry overnight I don't know why I chose to wash these today because I had a date that night y'all and I had maybe like three or four brushes and I really had to rely just on like my beauty blender for the majority of my application. But y'all gonna see my face in the end when I went out and I got dressed and everything. We were still on point with it, okay? So after that, I kind of just double checked a few rooms around the house to see which candles had burned all the way down so that I could put new ones. After that, I kind of just... After that, I replaced any candles around the house that had burned down for a few new ones. And uh, I double checked my candle cabinet and I was like, there go my coaster. <laughs> so I went ahead and finally opened that. Y'all, yeah, I ordered this stuff last year. But I'm that person like midway through burning the candle. If I get a new one, it's like, I don't care if this one hasn't burned down yet. I'm going to put it back into the cabinet and get out another one. that I went ahead and unpackaged a few other products took my shower and then I just chilled for the rest of the day until it was time for me to go ahead and get ready I'm kind of gonna take y'all with me not really and also if you all like my hair that video did go out before this one I'll link it down below for you all to check it out I hope you all have enjoyed this vlog and I will talk to you all in the next one Part two, so crazy right now I look this there so deep in your eyes I touch on you more and more every time when I leave I'm begging you not to go call your name two three times in a row such a funny thing for me to try to explain How I'm feeling and my pride is the one to blame Cause I know I don't understand Just how you love you do what no one else can